<laughs> okay, let's go for it. We're all set. I have the image just over there. Hopefully you have your image and you might have printed it out, but it doesn't, you don't really need it uh, because I'm going to guide you anyway, okay? Just have a sip of tea first. Ah, yes, lovely. Do you like my mug? Okay, let's go. What we're going to do is we're just going to use our white pastel pencil or pastel stick if you have it, soft pastel, or a piece of paint on, on a brush. I just prefer to use the pastel. And basically, we're just going to get in sort of converging lines like that okay first of all can you see that just converging lines there like that then we're going to do the same here converging there like that okay and you can actually bring this line down more okay that's going to come down there and then this one shorter okay and just your converging lines coming out here like that that's disappearing out there to the edge now do you see how loose I'm doing it because there's no no big deal about these lines okay it's a bit of fun doing it. it. Took a bit to work it out, but I'm bringing those lines in there. Okay, can you see that? Because we want these roosters at different different heights. Okay. So can you see what I'm doing there? Can you see that? Just one, giving those curved, rotund shape there. Can you see that? Like it's just uh, just basic shapes, really. If you think of them converging the lines all the time. Okay. And then next, we want to get in. I think it's called comb, is it on the top of the head? And all we're going to do is, it's like a few little uprights like that. We bring it down, cut it in there like that. Bring it down there as well, okay? Because what you want to do is you want to leave a little bit of room for his beak. Can you see that? And then we bring it back out here again, down there like that. And then a little guy out there like that, okay? So we have that in. Now we can make it even bigger if you want. Then we go on to the next guy down here. He's lower, okay? So we have him down like so. Have it, put in his beak first coming out there like that, okay? So you can get a better, better handle on it. Then his comb is gonna come up here, around there like that. Same idea, it gets higher as it goes up towards the back. And then it comes in there, back in around like that. You can have that yellow part going in there. And then the same idea, a bit frilly at the edges like that, okay? Out there in front, curving back in, you know? To give a nice curve on it there, okay? Can you see that? I'm gonna bring it out there as well like that. And that's one, two. And what we can do is, just so as you can make sense of it, just put a little circle in there, just so as it'll make sense for you where we are. 